Unfortunately, fender benders can turn into heated debates between both parties, leaving it up to insurance companies and law enforcement officers to determine what happened. When you install the Wolfbox G900 touchscreen parking monitoring dash cam and smart mirror, it will record both in front of and behind you, giving you outstanding views as you drive, as well as evidence if you should need to go to court. I took the dash cam for a test drive to ensure it performs exactly as needed to record driving footage. I was excited to unbox the Wolfbox G900 and test it out. The equipment comes in a small box with everything carefully packaged. This made unboxing easy and I could remove each item with no problem. The Wolfbox G900 includes the following components. One 4K 12-inch mirror dash cam. One 11.5-foot power supply. One 2.5K rear camera. One 20-foot rear camera cable. One GPS module and one 64 gigabyte micro SD card. The front camera is pre-attached to the dash cam screen mirror and the micro SD card is pre-installed in the mirror. The mirror is relatively heavy, but durable. The rear camera is small, making it easy to attach to the rear of your car, even when space is limited due to the vehicle's contours. Additionally, the kit includes the necessary pieces for installation. Four rubber components to attach the front dash cam mirror, one easy pry tool, one rear camera bracket, four cable clamps to root or hold wires, one cleaning cloth, and one user manual. Once I unboxed the Wolfbox 900, it was time to install and set everything up in my 2020 Chevrolet Equinox. Installing the screen cam and the front camera is simple. The device attaches to an existing rear view mirror with two rubber straps that snap into hooks at the top and bottom of the dash cam. This makes the system adjustable to mirrors of any size in virtually any vehicle. Once installed, the front camera can be adjusted in any direction. Use your hand to move the camera until it is optimally placed in front of your vehicle. Then plug the dash cam in using the provided power cord and adapter for your auxiliary power outlet. If desired, you can use the dash cam with just the front camera, which I personally appreciate. The rear camera includes a 20-foot wire kit, making it easy to reach the back of any vehicle. The camera adheres to the rear of the vehicle near the tail light and license plate and comes with an extra mounting component if needed. However, installing the rear camera is much more complicated than the front, especially for specific vehicle models. You must run the cable to the back of the car by first removing the trim inside your car so that you can run the cable from the front mirror to the back. Wolfbox includes a tool to do this, but I found it difficult to use with my vehicle and I wasn't thrilled with the damage left after using it. Next, Wolfbox recommends that you remove the tailgate trim and run the cable from the outside of your car to the trunk. This posed multiple issues for my SUV. The entire interior trunk of my car is a single hard plastic piece. There is no way to run a cable along any trim, nor is there an easy way for me to get the cable to the outside of the car. Next, Wolfbox asks that you pop out a component above the license plate and install it, but this also poses an issue for me as the button to open my trunk is directly above my license plate and is not removable in any way. After hours of trying to solve the issues I encountered, I decided to run the cable from the tail light and use the provided insulation materials to mount it just to the side of the tailgate button. I couldn't find any information on Wolfbox's website that provided solutions for different types of vehicles. Despite the difficult installation, the end result is well worth the work, especially if you don't currently have a vehicle that includes a rear camera. One of the key benefits of the Wolfbox G900 dash cam is the numerous controls included. Thanks to the touch screen, you can easily toggle into the settings and adjust the following. Dash cam resolution, recording split time, sound recording, G sensor, sensitivity, flicker, screensaver mode, click tones, volume, screen brightness, display mode, rear image adjustment. The settings you establish remain in place even if you turn the dash cam off and back on. They can also be adjusted at any time. As soon as everything is hooked up, you must plug the power cord into the dash cam mirror and turn the device on. The power button is located at the bottom centre of the mirror and you can turn it off and on at any time. When powered off, the mirror functions as a typical rear view mirror. However, unlike other mirrors of its kind, the G900 does not contain any anti-glare film, making it clearer than its competition. When turned on, you can use the cameras to see everything. The installation instructions for the dash cam recommend tucking the wires for the power and rear camera into the trim. The video on the Wolfbox website even shows them running the power cable across the passenger side of the car and the rear camera wires along the top of the driver's side. However, you run into a small issue with wires crossing by doing this as the power is on the left, the rear camera port is on the right and the power cord has an angled end. I found this to be slightly frustrating and a questionable design choice. 
The alternative is to run the power along the driver's side, but then this puts the power cord under your feet as you try to drive, making it a less than ideal solution, even with the mat on top of the cord. The Wolfbox G900 displays views from both cameras, making it easy to see both in front and behind you. The display is incredible, providing crystal clear views from both cameras with a 170 degree field of view. There are no risks of blind spots, especially as cars pass you. I also found this helpful as many people park on the street in my neighbourhood and I must parallel park. Anytime the dash cam mirror is turned on, it records footage from both cameras and saves the file to your included micro SD card. Each camera, front and rear, saves as individual files which you can review directly on the dash cam mirror or download to your computer. This can be especially helpful in an accident or a situation requiring video evidence. The cameras perform in any environment, daylight, night, rain and sunshine. The rear camera doesn't perform quite as well at night as it does during the day, but everything is still visible. The front camera is excellent, even at night, thanks to the headlights. Overall, the Wolfbox G900 touchscreen parking monitoring dash cam smart mirror is an outstanding option for anyone who wants dual dash cameras and full views in front of and behind their vehicles. It performs well in any setting, includes a variety of outstanding settings and features, and is fairly easy to install. You can purchase the Wolfbox G900 directly from Wolfbox, link in the description for $249.99. Okay, that's all for now. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.